In The Living Daylights, the 15th James Bond film, Timothy Dalton makes his debut as 007. It's all so boring here, Margot. If only I could find a real man. She'll call you back. Who are you? Bond, James Bond. To portray a classic hero, the producers turned to a classically trained actor, Timothy Dalton. A distinguished star of the British stage, international films and television, he brings his own special interpretation to the role of James Bond. He's a man that fulfills a lot of fantasies, I think probably both male and female. Whether you call them strengths or weaknesses, I mean, hard drinking, hard smoking, hard driving, uh, womanizing. If you're working as a secret agent, you can't become emotionally involved. But having set that up, that hard side to the man's character, he then always, he then always had a, a moment of vulnerability when he fell for a woman. Don't. It's impossible. Knowing you only two days, and all I can think of is how we would be together. Don't think. Just let it happen. The Living Daylights takes Timothy Dalton across three continents and through the twists and turns of a complex tale of international intrigue. His adventures are as imaginative and exotic as any that James Bond has ever faced. Well, I'm very, very fond of the Ian Fleming books, and there's a, a fairly clear understanding to be gained of Bond from those books. You know, the man is a complex man. Um, he's a man who lives uh, very much on the uh, edge of his life, constantly surrounded by the, by the threat of being killed. James Bond. After 25 years, the adventure continues.